If you haven't noticed, General Nakazone hasn't been fired since Biden became president, and we all have to ask ourselves why. Why in the world has General Nakasone not lost a job, but then a lot of these other jobs are being replaced? And we'll tell you it's because Obama and Biden were actually pretty close with General Nakasone and these people at Cyber Command. And um, my understanding of the situation is that it was the NSA that blackmailed Donald Trump um, to control his political appointments. And so when we wonder who's responsible, apparently it's not even the FBI. Um, the FBI had nothing to do with the blackmail. It was people that are hackers with the NSA, which the NSA a lot of time is very connected to the military. And so um, when we talk about who is responsible for the censorship right here, uh, that was the NSA, that wasn't the FBI. Um, the NSA probably is who's responsible for uh, robbing me so many times also. They stole my magic crystals. Seriously, when I was in Santa Barbara, they robbed me to steal my crystals because I made them think that I was doing I was doing magic. I was Satan doing magic. Seriously, that happened. And, yeah, seriously, and um, they robbed me every time I they robbed me every time I tried to make music. So if I'm gonna record music, they robbed me. And so I finally just got a microphone. If you've heard my music, you should listen to it. I'll, I'll put a link to it at the end. I'm Crystal Streets, and I'm also Glass Roads. Um, if you've listened to my music. I just recorded music now because my grandmother died. I got $5,000, so I got a new microphone. Couldn't record mu music before. Why? Because I got robbed. There's this guy, Matt, robbed me, uh, who was my friend, and he's the same guy that told me that the reason that, that I got harassed so much and the reason that the FBI did so much terrible stuff to me is because my people had set me up to look guilty. But um, probably Matt is FBI, I'm guessing, or DEA. I'm not 100% sure. Um, I'm sure you guys know at this point who he is. Um, what I'm trying to say is, um, who's actually responsible for the censorship? The NSA. Uh, who's responsible for a lot of the dirty things that have happened in the United States? The NSA. Um, my last job I, that I, I had, I was sharing an office with a guy that, was, that wrote the President's Daily Briefing for the NSA. He was a Marine, and uh, he said he didn't know General Nakasone, he, but he knew Condoleezza Rice. Um, and he was actually a really nice guy, but I don't, I, I would probably want, I'd want to talk to him to see who knows what if I was a politician. Um, and he, he, he could probably give you some pretty interesting information. Uh, one other thing I was going to mention, I said that Tesla uses carbon fiber for their frames. They don't use, they use aluminum. No one uses carbon, carbon fiber for the frames. They use carbon fiber for their exterior. Um, and I guess, I guess I don't, but they do use a lot of things to make their cars lightweight. Apparently GM's doing a great job on um, trying to make their batteries more efficient and trying to, or trying to make their batteries not use as many rare earth minerals. Like they're trying to use aluminum in their batteries. So I don't know, I, I might look into getting a GM. I'm not 100% sure which kind of car I'm gonna get uh, when I have money, but I haven't been allowed to make money legally. So that, I believe that's because people don't want me to get a lawyer. And YouTube especially doesn't want me to get a lawyer because I will sue the shit out of them. Um, and so once I get a lawyer, th then um, some people are going to have a lot of lawsuits on their hand. That includes Facebook for um, censoring me and also for um, preventing me from contacting people to confirm the censorship. So um, I don't know, that Cadillac Lyric looks really nice. I mean, I, w I would love to get a giant vehicle like a Hummer or a um, Cybertruck, but the reality is that we can't have all, all have what we want, uh, which is giant vehicles and a future at the same time. And a lot of us need to accept that uh, having smaller vehicles is how we survive. It's how we keep the weight of the cars down. Um, but more than anything, I think a lot of us need to go off cars completely. We need to revamp our public transportation system so it can patch into the power grid so that we can use electricity that's generated through clean energy um, to transport ourselves. And we need to accept that um, not all of us need cars and that our communities need to be thought out better. I've talked about it in the past, um, having college university type um, arrangements for our communities so that we have community and we have um, ways that we can eat together that make food consumption more e efficient and um, so that we can ha have happiness while also um, having a clean future or having having a future at all because if we keep if everyone is is acting like we are right now which is every man for themselves then we're not going to have a future